Hey guys, how's it going? Today I wanted to do just kind of a quick review for you guys on the FLIR C2 thermal camera. Um, I hadn't seen too many reviews on this, so I thought I'd just kind of give you guys my two cents, just kind of based off my experience and let you know what I thought about it. Um, I should mention too, I found a pretty good deal on this. I'll put a link to that uh, in the description below so you can check that out if you're interested in picking it up for yourself. So FLIR, if you're not kind of familiar with them, they're pretty much kind of the gold standard for thermal imaging cameras these days. Um, the C2 is their most popular model. Um, it's their most affordable model, but it really does work good. Um, if you're using it, it has a lot of uses to be honest, but the majority of people are going to be looking for like cold leaks or heat link heat leaks in their home and it works unbelievably good for that. For one, you can specify a range of temperatures that you're looking for. Um, so it appears, uh, it adjusts to that on the gradient scale on the uh, actual camera itself. What that basically just means is it's just really easy to see where either cold air is coming in or hot air is coming in. It's got a plus or minus uh, accuracy of two Celsius, which is really good. And it's nice and small and compact, um, built like an absolute tank too. You could drop this thing over and over and nothing's going to wrong. It's really kind of uh, industrial grade, I guess you could say. But it makes it really easy to see if you suspect you might have like a water leak in the ceiling. You'll see a big cool area in your ceiling. You can see if some of your uh, appliances or electronics or wall switches are overloaded. They'll look real warm. Um, you can see what parts of your walls are missing insulation or aren't insulated well. So you could perhaps correct that and save a lot of money on electricity or gas. Another thing worth mentioning too is their software is really good. If you want to hook it up to uh, the FLIR tools on the computer, it's simple, easy to use, and works very well. It has a 9 hertz refresh rate as well, which means it will refresh the image 9 times per second, which is higher than a lot of other thermal cameras. Um, but yeah, overall, really like this thing, highly recommend it. For what its purpose is, it's the best one out there and it works great in my opinion. So anyway, if you guys have any more questions about it, just leave them in the comments below. Thanks for watching and have a great day.